lot of characters. Dude, I, really I can't think of any character that compares to like Little Mac or. Uh, yeah, Little Mac or. Gannon. Whoa. Oh. Yo, Malgus. Yo, he's Real? in the top tier. Yo, I can't believe this. What is this? We don't. Dude. What happened to the Ganon? What happened to the Ganon? Yo, yo, this is what I'm talking about, SoCal. Let's pick up some top tiers. That's what I'm talking about. Dude, get kill this, get kill this man at 40 with down smash. Get that character loyalty out of here. We're trying to win. Dang, dude. <laughs> not. I wouldn't expect this from a Ganon main. That's yeah. that's actually wild. I'm kind of mind blown right now. Yeah, I know. Like, because okay, so I talk to Lord Bahamut every now and then, and I know he likes to play the Belmonts, and he liked Cloud Ooh. as well. Yeah. But he was, he's still loyal, like really loyal to Ganon. He might play like the other two characters here and there, but he will almost always start out with Ganon, if not always. And did, that, was that a dare? Was that, that, that was a dare. That was a dare trade? Right there, Sax tried to go for a down air. Oh. He didn't really, really trade. He got the sour hit, and he, but he fast fell, so he just died. Yeah, he, that died he, at like he might have had Smash Stick. And if, I know if you have Smash Stick and you dare, you, you fast fall, right? Yes. Or that, that's yes. how it was in Smash 4. I think just even with Tilt Stick in this game, you do that now. Oh, really? I'm not too sure. RIP, dude. But still. He, that first off, he died at like what? 50, 60% of that sweet spot down smash? Oh, no. He got hit up to 98. So he like got hit at like 70 ish. Okay. But still, a very amazing percent to get the kill out in this game. And Malg is showing his. Uh, oh, 165, and he's still alive here. Sax trying to get the stock finally. The back air connects. All right. I'm still in shock that Malgus is playing Wolf of all characters. Dude, yeah, that, that, like, that, man, that Nair is not working out. Um, looks like Malgus is able to sneak underneath it. Wolf is so good at this game. Yeah, you, you can't, if you play Wolf, you can't really disguise it either. For the most part, you're like, you're a tier horse to play Wolf. There I mean, there's, like, kind of some people that play, oh, down smash though. Oh, dang, okay, goes for another laser, you know, can't, I gotta respect the safe play. All right. Wow. Wait. That down smash is so little lag that he w couldn't even punish that with getup attack. That's wild. And Malgus, look at that stoic look. He's like, dang, that's how that's how it feels like. Yo, just get these uh, get these kills. Yo, but that's how it feels to have power in my hand. To, uh, Dude, to play a good character. The power character. of a top tier, bro. The g a good character. I don't have to suffer at the hands of Yo, the top tiers. Oh, I'm so mind blown right now. He, he brings the terror not from a powerhouse or like a big man who kills you at like 20. He's, he has the power of a small man. He two stalked them, and like I feel like the inner Ganon would be like, "Yo, I two stalked them with dude. Like, I could just go Ganon, but he's he sticking with his guns, dude. Yeah. Why switch off this character? He's such a solid character. Oh, down throw dash tag. Oh, tries to get the pickup after another down throw tech chase here. Doesn't nail it. The tech away. Yeah, the down throw dash tag. The, it's a very, it's a very small window, especially against fast ballers. You're only gonna clip from like maybe five or seven ish to about like twenty percent and get the grab. All right. Wow, anti-air really? forward tilt. Wow. You can angle left tilt, right? Yes. Okay. Yeah, F tilt, very amazing move. Pretty much like a sword move. Nair into the uh, dash tag there. Down smash. Ooh, Ooh. I like the high Ooh. side B. Yeah, that caught him. The high uh, phantasm from Sax is going to nail him that uh, setup into the back air, killing that uh, stock from Malgus fairly early here. Okay, down smash. Oh, tries to go for angle down forward tilt. Another option that hits below the ledge. Yeah, it's a little bit safer. Comes out, then comes out faster. What is it? The same frame date, actually. Uh, I'm pretty sure F tilt comes out quicker. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm just gonna assume because it's a tilt move. Yeah. All right. So good job on Saxon. We're actually having the lead in this one, not really falling behind. I'm yeah. He did not SD. Yeah, really. true. Yeah, he, so he did SD game one. So that does help. But I feel like Malgus is kind of playing a little bit too reserved. Yeah, a lot of blasters. Um, we haven't seen a lot of uh, setups with Falling Fair. That's a little bit more committal. Oh, okay. wow, that was great. grabs. All right. Ooh, he actually got the, okay. Oh no, this is where, this is where he, oh wow, going for the back air there. I feel like Malgus has been sticking to his guns with like angle down forward tilt and down smash. Maybe should have done it there, but went for the little greedy play, didn't pay off. Probably doesn't feel a little bit comfortable yet enough to go for down smash. Ooh, I see, okay, or not, well, sack. Sax fading back there, trying to get Malgus to double jump, and he did and got that back air. Yeah. It was looking pretty scary because Malgus was living to like 150. So the one thing that Falcon still does is that really fast and powerful back air. Oh man, yo, Sax is going in right now. That 0 to 48, oh. but the down smash. Catching that air dodge will kill him. Yeah, very nicely timed there from Malgus. Very good read. 
Oh, ooh, wow, that was a juicy grab there. Oh, the dash attack into... Wow, that was so much damage. And he got, like, a weird lingering anti-air hit of dash attack. Oh, Ooh, what a call the double out. jump. Yep, that will kill. All right, Sax getting the down air. He's been looking for all set. Going to nail it on game number two here. Yeah, I, feel, I want to see Malgus play a little bit more aggressive. He's a little bit too reserved to keep... And especially in that last interaction, he didn't really sit at the ledge. He just kind of ran back and forth and gave up control over it. Right, right. Like. And yeah. With, Wolf, with Wolf's kid, I feel like you should stay there. Oh, yeah. Wolf has... Wolf can do amazing ledge trapping, so... You have F-Tilt, you have Down Smash, you have up smash to catch rolls and whatnot. And then you... Does, wait, does Down Tilt two-frame? Yes. It hits below the ledge. So you can hit people off the ledge if they hang too long. All right. Okay, Malga starting it off with the blasters here. Okay, gonna get that nice nair into grabbing the dash attack. Oh, wow, he, he like positioned himself to catch that as well, but just didn't pull the trigger there. But already, Malga starting off really strong here, 51%. Okay, I see what Malga's is trying to do with the dash back and forth. He's trying to bait out Sax to use the illusion and to punish it. Uh, yeah. Oh, I like the laser. Wow, it's the F smash. Oh, that was bad DI. Yeah, that, that was, was there's yeah. no way. <laughs> yeah, that was. Definitely the sus DI there. Maybe Malgus just trying to DI away, get out of the combo. But wow, it is going to result in his death now. Malgus down an entire stock here. This is very doable. Wolf has a lot of kill power. But it seems like Sax kind of got the rhythm of Malgus now. He's kind of. He's, he's running the train right now. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, and Wolf's uh, smash attack very. Oh, down uh, So scary. Oh, didn't finish the jabs though. Sax going to retaliate with the jabs of his own. But can Malgus get this stock? It feels like he's been going for it, but has not been hitting the fuzzy dice. Oh, back air, not. He went for the double jump instead. Maybe he didn't believe. There's some questionable uppies. Yeah, I mean, sometimes it's. Oh, oh hey, wow. Catch catches the roll with up smash, yeah. Even though the stock's 70%. Not too hard for Wolf to bring back, but Malgus hasn't really shown that he knows the fair strength. Or maybe he's just not comfortable with it. Okay. Oh, yeah, falling fair streams are super, super fun. Yeah. I mean, if you're not... Oh, okay. I'm pretty sure that was a misinput. Even if you're not comfortable with the fair strings, like right there, Malgus could have just falling fair in a grab, you know, down throw dash tag. Yeah. It's, it's kind of like chic, like fair grab, you know, fourth throw bouncing fish from Smash 4. Yeah. Um, but yeah, even if you don't know the fair strings, like, you can just fair to fair to fair. It's not, like, the optimal thing to do, but it's very, like, 30%. Easy. It's very simple and easy, yeah. Your opponent ends up in the air as well, so that can definitely be a go-to. But if the if the stocks are oh easy, wow, man, these people are really ballsy with the <laughs> oh oh wow. I feel like that could have been a down smash. Yeah, definitely. Oh wait, oh, oh good tech. yeah, and it was techable. Oh, wow. that's bad again. No. Okay. Oh, he should. Was that a regrab? Um, no, that wasn't. Okay. He, he would have had tangibility with the back here, but I mean, Malgus got a lot of percent. Yeah, so no. he brought he, that back pretty hard. Oh, but right now the combos are going to come out, and definitely Falco has that on deck. Again, going to start something else up already at 55%. Yeah, these up bees are tough. Malgus is kind of throwing. I don't know where the idea behind them is. Yeah, I feel like he's just trying to catch him off guard. It kind of stalls you out in the air, and it's a kill move. Um, but at the end, I feel like Malgus is getting a little fishy with these kills, kind of fishing for him. But Sax is just going to wait. I feel like that whole last stock, Sax is kind of just like, all right, you you really want this kill, so you're going to keep yeah. swinging for it, and I'm going to like fade back, see what you do, react, punish, punish, Yeah, he punish. saw all these uppies coming, and I was like, okay, he wants to kill me, and I should just hold shield then. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I feel like Malgus got maybe a little anti slash nervous there on that last stock. He really just wanted to close the stock out yeah. and kind of just stretched out a little bit. 